Hello, everybody. Glass half dead here. Today, I'm joined by Isaac. Hello, Isaac. You are playing Chaos Legionary. I am playing Phobos Strike Team. Do you want to very quickly run us down what you've taken? Um, so yeah, I got a mixed team of Corn and Undivided and uh, Zinch. I got Bellfire Acolyte with a crack grenade. He's a Zinch guy. He's going to blow someone up, hopefully. Plasma Gunner hiding in the back here. That's a Zinch dude. Butcher, Corn, of course. He's got a crack. Um, Shrive Talon, ready to put his uh, token on the middle objective so that Andy can't take any of it. Yeah, that's going to... Yeah. And Possessed Guy, just chilling at the back there on Conceal. Awesome. And you also want to tell us uh, which archetype you've gone whilst you flip the cards over so that I don't look at them. Uh, <laughs> I went for security. I haven't, I haven't seen them yet. Good, good, good. I went for security and um, I also took Faction Attack Up 2 uh, in the deck. Might not have picked it. I don't know what it is, so that's fine. So you um, can say it. So what it does is it's, uh, if I kill anyone within a one inch of a terrain feature, I get a point. Um, you can tell me that, because I can't stop There's that. a pretty good <laughs> terrain yeah, yeah, to kill Andy next to yeah. right here. There's literally nothing I can do about that. <laughs> yeah, cool. That's fair, that's fair. Okay, whereas, um, oh, is equipment? Uh, three crack grenades. Couldn't be bothered to think about it. Crack yes. grenades. Yeah, that's going to be, yeah. So I have also taken three crack grenades, mm. and then I'm the Phobos team this time. My first time playing Phobos, the last two times I've played that I've played Mark, I've taken uh, the Blooded. So I faced them. I haven't played them yet. And one thing I know about them is that they're very... I think to win with them, you have to know the synergies. And I don't yet, so there's mm. going to be... You might have to help me a bit on this one, Isaac. Sure. Um, I've also gone three crack grenades, because why wouldn't you? And I've gone a Reaver Sergeant. I don't think that's actually a good pick in this matchup, but he's a really cool model. So this is a no nice narrative, fluffy game. Not a data sheet. Model and he specifically no, yeah, the model. got yeah, yeah, yeah. Lieutenant from uh, yeah, Shadow right. Sphere. No, 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 that's my veteran. Oh, that's my veteran. This is just the, the Reva um, captain. Oh, the standalone guy, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then I've also gone a comms there, I've gone a Vox Breaker there, I've gone a Mine Layer, so not the Saboteur, a Mine Layer, the Incursor Mine Layer. Uh, I've gone the veteran who I've given, who has, oh, what's his, the, he the can customize his gun. So he's gone with Lethal 5-Up and P1, P1, which I think is probably the, always the right choice. I'm not sure when you'd go against Demons. somebody else. Oh, well, sure, yeah, 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 and Void Dancers, maybe. Yeah. Uh, and then, of course, I've gone Marksman. I think if I were to redo this team, because obviously I'm playing the models I've got, um, I think I'd probably, now that I've kind of gotten into them a little bit more, I'm, I'm liking the Vox Breaker less, and I'd probably try playing a Saboteur and a Mine Layer. Oh, because yeah. that would also then open up the idea of using one of their faction tack ops, because you have something that interacts with Saboteurs. Yeah, yeah. The You've got to blow word. up three tokens. Yeah. And so if you only have one guy, well, that's almost impossible. impossible. You need to. So that's something I'll think about in the future. But for this, those are my six guys. Um, I'm excited to see what happens. I don't expect to win. We were talking about this earlier. Mm. You okay? So you said that if you took Nurgle, there would be no way I could win. The game would be over. And I agree. <laughs> yeah, like I don't think I have the firepower to break through power armor, five up saves. Bolt guns doing two slash three damage. It's a las gun. It's not gonna. It's not yeah. gonna hurt me. So yeah, yeah, um, definitely. I went um, with Zeech. More reasonable. <laughs> Yes, I told you you should take Nurgle, like make it as tough a game as possible, you know, like, because some people... It would have been fun. Because obviously this, this is Morok release week, right? Uh, so most people are going to be here to see the Phobos, but some people are here to see the Legionary. Mm. So I say, yeah, play them as best you can um, and take whatever you want. Ultimately, you chose to go with this, totally fine. Uh, I think you're going to take it anyway. I think this is a bad matchup for the Phobos, and I also think... This possibly is a bit of an interesting board for the Phobos. This is, there's a lot of heavy here, and even though I have two incursors mm -hmm. that have multi-spectrum array... So obscurity called. happens four inches rather than two inches for the people that they're shooting at. Yes, which is pretty big, mm. pretty big. Um, it's it's going to make it harder for you to hide, but not that hard on this board. Yeah. Yeah, uh, so I just assume you're going to win. I assume it's going to be a very standard, everybody moves turn one. Like, mm. maybe someone throws a grenade. But, yeah, yeah. But that's it. Uh, and then turn two, you will charge all of my models. Mm. That's what I think is going to happen. Yes, that's yeah, right. Yeah. And knowing how I play, I think for me to stop that, I'd have to be more experienced with the team and know how to play them better. Yeah. 
Yeah. So this is going to be, I suspect, a quick game. The other thing to note is that obviously we're playing with the marked terrain, just like uh, I played oh, the blooded. Yes. At, that's right, the the blooded <coughs> and the Phobos uh, yesterday. But that means, and we're playing domination, and so we've done a slight uh, narrative, you know, very narrative mm. game. This uh, where we've put one of the objectives, the center objective, up off of the kill zone floor. There you go. That's yeah. yeah. And this is low, so it only takes two inches to climb. Yes, that's right. Yes, so low is a new keyword that we've had put into Morok, which means that, you, you know, you can give it to anything. It's just uh, one circle to go up and one circle to go down. Mm. But due to the way drop works, that means it's free to go down. Yes, yes, yeah. which is cool. pretty good. Yes. OK, so with that done, we've already done our initiative phase and it turns out that I, we both did uh, swap an order, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, and, you, and then because you're the attacker, you said that I'm going to go first. You're going first. Awesome. Bring so it on. with that done, let's get into it. Let's go for it. My mine layer moves up and plants the mine on the other side of the central wall, then dashes back enough to challenge the point. What's his name again? Is it mine layer? <laughs> Is that really his name? Yeah. Let me think. So I, I can move and dash right here and shoot you with overcharged plasma. I and mean, that's what I've done. That's what I've done. Are you so, sure? Yeah, that's what I've done. That's, that's the move I've made. Are you absolutely sad? Look, if I'm a bad player, I'm a bad player. I'm not going to be able to hide it. Drive Talon moves to the point and drops his grizzly token. This triggers the Haywire Mine, getting a crit and three hits. He saves two and takes six damage. He gets minus one APL from stun. My Vox Breaker moves, taps the point, then dashes. His Acolyte dashes, taps the point, then moves back. My Veteran moves up. Yeah, he's quite an aggressive male. Um... His Butcher moves up to hold the point. My Reaver Sergeant moves up and shoots the Butcher with his Bolt Pistol. I CP reroll, so get a crit and three hits. He fails two saves. It will do 13 damage, but he chooses to spend 2 CP to reroll both dice and saves 1, letting him live on 5 health. I play attacks as if there is a designated reroll phase, so you have to declare every reroll in the pool at the same time instead of seeing what each reroll gives you. I then dash into cover. His anointed moves up. My comms moves up and comms is the leader. The leader does strategize, so I gain 1 CP. His plasma gunner moves up and goes hot against the mine layer, taking him to one health left. My marksman moves up, shoots the plasma. I CP reroll my 1 into a 1. He saves 1 and takes 6 damage. He moves up with his leader, goes hot on the plasma, re-rolls a 1 thanks to Zinch and kills my Reaper Sergeant no matter what I roll, so I don't even roll the save. Okay, so end of round 1 there. Um, I announced recon with triangulate and vantage right at the beginning, mm. but then completely forgot to score them for the, whole, for the whole round, which is definitely a mistake. Yeah. But you know, that's me. Mm. Uh, I've got to be honest, I don't play recon that often. Yeah. Um, if I had remembered it, probably wouldn't have done what I did, but what, it, what happened was I got so focused on the center and using my mine layer um, to like potentially block you, yeah. that did not work. And of course it wouldn't against the power armor team. Yes. If you were, you know, uh, more of a, uh, a guard. guard team, yeah. team then, then that would be a very different story. I took seven, seven damage from the man. You did, yeah, not bad. Not Pretty bad, and, and with the three up armor save there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but yes. Actually, you didn't care, you just charged straight into it. Yeah, um, so as it turns out, the stun rule doesn't actually do anything in terms of how many activations I can do. Um, all it did was mean that I was one less on holding the objective, but he didn't want to score it anyway, because my Shrive Talon popped the, uh, the marker Here's down. The token. Yeah, so for the rest of the game, yeah. Andy pretty much cannot get the middle point. Said, yes, true. I think, also, I misplayed that. So the way you're supposed to use that token is plant it when almost like a short range grenade. Make sure you have multiple enemy models. Uh. Like, because otherwise, 
yes, it's a bit of an area denial, but only for one model possibly. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. The way it was like this, like if I had managed to move further mm. and place it there, that would have been a devastating attack. Yes. So I, I uh, you know, because of my inexperience with the team, didn't mm. know that's how it should be played. Of course. Done. Um, then you killed my leader. Yes. With your leader. Ran off and plasmaed him in the face. Yep, which is exactly what plasma does. Yeah. Um, especially when it's your leader, so it's hitting on twos. And has a reroll because of undivided. Yeah, and you overcharge. Th yeah. Yes. That's, that's what a plasma does. Uh, you then got your second plasma, took one of my guys down to one health left. Yep. So it's looking poor so far. <laughs> yeah. uh, but, you know, like, like we said, that was, that was kind of what I expect to happen. Of Although, course. A turn before I expected it to happen. Oh, I think, right. <laughs> I, th I think this is going to be the turn where you win because now everyone can charge, basically. Yeah. So, uh, which is where you are significantly stronger than, than me. Yeah. Um, yeah. So cool. I guess uh, this will be a nice short game. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet. We're we'll quick. Uh, I guess one of the big things I'm finding about this is this terrain, even from this relatively high vantage point, is just can't see anything. Yeah. Uh, even with the incursor who's doing the... Four inch. Still doesn't work. Nothing. Yeah, it's yeah. right through the air. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's... Let, oh, shall we roll off to see who's going first? Here we go. Three of five, course. You go first. My, my dice. So this will be a nice, quick <laughs> turn two. Let's go. All right, let's do it. Turn two and his leader charges, kills the mine layer, then overcharges his plasma into my Vox Breaker, one-shotting him. I don't even roll my defense dice. Marksman shoots the plasma gunner, killing him, then shuffles forward to get line of sight on the center. Flux blast, whatever it is. Uh, oh wow, that's three crits because of Zinch. Is there AP? Uh, no AP. This is a one, I'm going to reroll it. Okay. Um. <laughs> His Balefire Acolyte kills the Marksman with four crits, then dashes back. My Veteran moves forward and shoots the Acolyte, leaving him on one hill. His Anointed moves up and crack grenades my comms, hitting three times, I'm left with three hill. Having all but given up, I choose to just roll some dice and shoot his anointed, leaving them on 5 health. I then charge and kill the butcher. He kills my comms with his Shrive Talon, I overwatch at the Bale Fire and get the kill. Uh, you know, Andy, I, I tried to pick a weak team today. What did I say? That's even worse. <laughs> no, no, as in like, worse. no, as in like... Okay, end of turn two there. Uh, we are now at me on two VP, you on five VP. I have mm -hmm. one model left on the board. You have three, so yeah. it was a bit of a bloodbath. True, um, kill three guys. You know, unfortunately, it was a bit of a bloodbath. You to me at the beginning, so I didn't have much to do. Yeah. And so I gave up and just started getting <laughs> kills instead of trying to score. Hence the VP differentiation, differential there. Mm. Um, how did that turn go for you? Well, um, I found out that your team doesn't have only a death to duty end. Yes. So, um, yeah, yeah. I almost let's totally take your models honest. and put them in the bin. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Well, neither do yours, right? True. True. So you know, th this is clearly Compendium Marines got that because they needed something. Oh right. Real teams, that's not a thing, right? Okay. Okay. And so actually, weirdly, only the vet guard. Get that weird only in death. Um, That's bespoke, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Okay. And Marines don't get it, which is odd. But yeah, yeah. that seems to be the thing. Okay. Um, and the plasma just went through and, and killed everything as yes. usual, the plasma pistol. Um, well, again, you know, you, your plasma, so you overcharged every shot. Yeah, and, and I get a one. free reroll yep. on my leader. Um, so you, and like AP2, AP2, yeah. f five, six damage, <laughs> making me only roll one dice. And then the other kill was a crack grenade, which is AP1. Of course. So, you know, um, yeah, that, that's, the, that's what this game is. It was madness. The Shrive Talent token hasn't even done anything because everyone's Not too dead to, really. to care about yeah. it, really. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. Uh, wow. Well. Yeah, I, I think we... I mean, obviously, it turned out much better for you, but 
Um, I think we both had some very interesting ideas about the central objective. Yeah. And I was like, oh, I'm going to put my mind down, and that'll keep me away from it. And you're like, yeah, yeah. no, I'm going to put my... It's like, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it's going to tank it. doesn't matter it. at all. Yeah. Um, suddenly, obviously, I'm going to concede. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I don't think that's a big shock. Uh, but I think the big things that set me back in this were exactly what we said at the beginning, which was that your team is able to just dominate turn two onwards. Yeah. Um, but also, there was so much heavy, I didn't really get to shoot a huge... Oh, I hit my mic. Um, I didn't really get to shoot a, a huge amount, which for most of them is fine, but I was definitely out of position with my marksman. Yeah. And I really feel that if his target... Lo- uh, target I think it's target lock, mm. isn't really doing much, then why have you taken him? Well, you know? like, this vantage actually does nothing for you, because everything's obscured, yeah. everything's obscured. Yeah. And this thing blocks visibility anyway. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So, like, going for this side, ah, uh, it's... So, I like this piece of terrain just because this is so tall. Strange. Yeah, it's a bit of an odd piece of terrain, similar to the Orc oil rig. Yeah. Less, less oh. annoying, like, less annoying, obviously, but it's kind of similar. Yeah, It's yeah. also very narrow and tall, so I, I agree, I'm not a huge fan of it. Mm. But, you know, again, these are beginner mistakes with a team that I haven't played before. And I was like, oh, I'm going to shoot him. But then, ah. Never mind. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, again, what we decided, we decided to put this in the centre of the board, knowing that it would do that. Yeah. But perhaps we hadn't quite fully realised that, mm, you know. You're not going to be able to shoot no, anything. No. Although, you know, in, in your defence, um, you shot me. True, true. I ran so, up and shot you in the face. Yeah, like, <laughs> we haven't done a single melee. Oh, no, one, when no, I charged you. Oh, and, and I got a kill in melee. Yes. Uh, against you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. wow. You, you killed Didn't my butcher. You? Yeah. Oh, because you were on one health. One, one health, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was mainly because you, turn one, you had two engaged guys here. Yes. And so they could just get killed. Yeah, yeah. So I think this is pretty classic. I've been too aggressive. Mm. Uh, <laughs> the thing is, I don't quite know what else I should have done in this scenario. Yeah. Um, what would you suggest? How would you have played that? Okay, so... Someone running up here and maybe getting a shot in there or just yeah. waiting for me to get engaged first because sure, you have sure. so few teams that I can't really do the charge and fight and kill two guys thing. Mm-hmm. So if I throw someone forward, shoot him back, bolt a discipline. Can you bolt a discipline and shoot twice with your sniper? Um, yes, you can, that... but not in their overwatch. Oh, of course, yeah. Or yeah, their yeah. track target thing, but you could move shoot twice, and then get the overwatch. Right, yeah. yeah, yeah. And the other thing would be scouting phase, try and get initiative, and give me initiative. Because uh, oh, well, I gave yeah, you initiative, sure. I could just have the last activation and run yeah, out yeah. and plasma someone. No, that is true. That so, is like, true. 6v6, always try and get to go second. Oh, I think you almost... I, I think always. generally se- going second is <laughs> always, almost, yeah. almost the, the better option. <laughs> yeah, And except the only time that you, when you don't can get want a dirty is, blast off or something. Sure, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, um, but yeah I, I, I agree. So that was obviously a relatively quick game, um, <laughs> which is great for me when it comes to editing. Oh, so you've conceded? Yeah. Oh, really? like, oh yeah. right. Okay. So not well, well, no, there's, there's nothing else to do, is there? <laughs> okay, um, fair like, enough. I mean, even if I get some kills and I manage, and you don't kill me, it doesn't change the score. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Because he would then just be shooting. Yeah. Uh, he can't really perform anything else. He might be able to score one or two more VP, but that's it. Yeah, yeah. Like, this is yeah. probably what turn three would look like. Something like well, that. Well, he'd be up there, or he'd pick this. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. That ends up being worth potentially two VP. But still, it's, it's not enough. Yeah. It's not enough. Um, yeah. So I think possibly a little bit more heavy terrain than normally would be played with, or not more, more pieces, but more dominating. Oh, there's definitely more heavy terrain. Look, this is, this is what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces of heavy. Sure, or Terrace sure. has five, so like, there's way more heavy. Yeah. Um. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I thought it, it was a learning experience mm. for the Phobos, and I think that, you know, the kind of thing you have to do on your first game to be like, oh, OK, that's how you play them. Yes. You know? So yeah, even yeah, though yeah. I've played against them twice, mm. really, from my perspective, it's just been, oh, they've moved and shot me. So when yeah. I played them, I'm like, well, I'm going to move and shoot them. Yeah, like, yeah, well, yeah. Hold on now, Andy. Bring it in. Bring it back a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. How did your legionaries go for you? If you ignore the fact that you destroyed me. Destroyed like, me. I mean, they worked exactly as I, I hope they would. I mean, the, 
they have a guy who's hitting on twos with plasma, reeling ones, the aspiring champion. He's not the chosen. And, you know, you just point and shoot, delete a model. Um, yeah. I didn't actually get to fight in melee with any of my, like, melee guys. Yep. So um, <laughs> don't worry about that. But, like, yeah. just crack grenades. I mean, when you're versus an elite team, it's just easy. You just take crack grenades and plasma and yes. kind of just blow them up. Um, yeah, for sure. It's that easy. For sure. And certainly when it comes to my guys, I'm not... In an odd way, so yes, I can still take three cracks, mm. but I can't say I don't have the ac that access to plasma. I yeah. have access to tricks, cool. not just raw, yeah, kill, yeah, raw kill, kill a guy, murdering, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, and then obviously I position myself poorly so that you could do that. Yes, um, yeah. Which you then took full advantage of, and that's obviously how you win the game. So yeah, of course, like you, yeah. You, you've played it well. I just wish they'd given the Phobos like a plasma pistol or something to be able to really like punch through armor. Like some um, real damage. In a way, I like that they haven't because obviously they've stuck to that sneaky team ideal. And true, true. They're not, well, the marksman's super good, I think, just as an individual. Yeah. Like, he doesn't really need support. But I think the rest of the team, you need, to, you need to be moving the comms, the vox breaker, you need to make them do things. Uh, turn off conceal. That sort so of that thing. So you could like, murder yeah, yeah. someone at this point. Yeah. Which I didn't do any of. <laughs> Of course, yeah, yeah. Like, I got two carried away, right. and then everybody else was too far back, and, and I realised that, oh, actually, yeah. now that he's here, you can plasma him. Of course. <laughs> but you're not going to do that till the last activation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, ah, oh, well, I've, I kind of gave, I almost gave the game away to turn yeah. one. I, I, I think yeah. on a map with, like, a less heavy, so, like, if this was, like, maybe, you know, something like that, you know, all of a sudden your vantage points... Or just nothing, it doesn't... Actually, you don't yeah, 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 or, or just nothing. Like, um, this is not a very shooting map. I think this map made you want to come to me. Yes, potentially. <laughs> and that's not good when I'm a melee <laughs> yeah. monster. Yeah, certainly that being in the center neutered the idea of using that to me. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. Because this is blocked by this, essentially. Mm. But then all of this, I mean, if I had stayed here on all of the vantage points, which should give me an advantage, yeah. you could have still won and never had my vantage, like, affect you. Yeah, yeah, that's um, true, that's true. Which is possibly a mistake. <laughs> uh, but, you know, we just threw this together quickly, wanting to use the Morag stuff. Of course. Exactly. Just nothing. A, nothing yeah. six v six Marines game, just a yeah. narrative fun. Na narrative, fluffy. So, so fluffy, fluffy that was, exactly. that was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> awesome, okay, well, uh, thanks for the game. I think we're gonna go reset, do another one. Sweet, um, And Thank see goodness. if we can, um, if I can play a little bit more sensibly, <laughs> yeah. Well, good game. Sounds good, man. Thanks for the game. Cheers. Bye. See you, guys. Yeah. Isaac Hunt, what a gentleman. <laughs> so, you're going Phobos and I'm going Legionnaires again, right? Yeah. Are you yeah. sure you don't want to swap? I always no. play a stronger team versus you, Andy. It's not.